and Lucina is better. It feels like Mark uh, is the Echo Fighter and Lucina oh is the actual God, fighter. Yeah. But we have Yoshi Freak, who uh, unfortunately is not going to go by his name. He's going to go Game & Watch. He's got the good up out of shield, so if he does get quote-unquote combo by Mark, eject Lucido out of there and find another way. But let's get into it, because he's got a grab, and he's going for some great neutral airs, and already the percents are racking up. Jesus Christ. I mean, you can just see how all of Game & Watch's tools just lead Mark to, like, not be able to land, you know, especially with that up air that, you know, it's kind of, they took away the win box a bit, but, you know, they made it a multi-hit, so it effectively yeah. does the same thing of, like, continuing to juggle and juggle, except you don't get that win box jank where, like, the win box, like, pushes you up without being mm -hmm. hit by the move, so you actually get damage off of it now. It's, it's kind of... You know, it's, it's the early morning, and I feel like Shadow Wolf hasn't really woken up because he's getting he's kind of getting sauced out here. But for his objective here, and I kind of understood, like, he did want to hit him with the back hit of Nair so he can go ahead and combo into a back air. He didn't want to go for falling up air. He's utilizing some of Mark's tools like that to go ahead and hit Yoshi Freak, but he's kind of being overwhelmed by something that of a character you don't really see too much often. I mean, you don't really see a lot of Game & Watches out there. Right. I mean, Game & Watch is a character who's all about, you know, baiting out oh. both options. Like, you see, a lot of those things that you think, like, oh, that's a super laggy move. No, it's not. Yeah, they're like more of a frame there, and that's right. what kind of got Shadow Wolf to lose the stock. I um, mean, yeah, I mean, Game & Watch just has, like, a lot of tools, especially that up out of shield, you know, like, everything just seems so disjointed, and because of his animations, it's hard to tell when his move is actually done, because, you know, a lot of characters will be like, oh, I'm going to end the move here, because that's when, when the follow-through of my swing is, but Game yeah. & Watch is just like, I'm here one second, and here's my frame the sec next second, and then I'm <laughs> back to resting position, and then there's no like in between frames and between we're back, his moves. And we're back into position for here for Shadow Wolf because he was right there in the corner struggling to get out and Yoshi Freak just knowing, hey man, right, this is how I took your stock the last time. I'm gonna take it here, especially at the corner. Goes for the full side B, not able to connect all the hits here. I definitely want to see Shadow Wolf kind of stick back. This is the point when you want to start to get the punish game going on and punish your opponent for overextending. You ha he has a lead, so Yoshi just oh. doesn't have to do too much. Yeah. I mean, Game Watch is there definitely is. a character that, you know, once he has the lead, he can just bully and pressure you as much as you want. Mm -hmm. So you want to force him to approach. Because his approach options are, like, it's back air at best, you yeah. know? And as long as you, like, wait for him to land with that and then punish the landing of oh. it, then, like, you're you're golden. But, you know, if you leak from getting edge guarded like that, I mean... I, I mean, I see it, too, because already Shadow Wolf didn't hold his recovery there. That's kind of what caused him to lose that sock. And it's because Yoshi Freak knows I can go for a down air and hold it, and then he's going to have to fall up to it because he has the up. He has nowhere else to go but here. So I caught his up. Which is good tech chase from Yoshi Freak with Shadow Wolf. Still looking for the stock. I do respect the up. E. It is frame five. But unfortunately, man, you're too overzealous. He has to stay calm. It's the early morning, man. You got to wake up. I mean, at this point, I feel oh. like, ooh, yeah, and there's that quick raw bear off stage, you mm -hmm. know. I feel like Shadow Wolf is just not really respecting Game Watch's tools, you know? A lot yeah. of the stuff that he's just like, oh, he's throwing out a How can move. you, though? How can you? How many? Look, let's be realistic here, man. How many times do you fight a Game of Watch and Breck? When? When When have you seen a Game of Watch? People have, like, Meister? That's one guy. <laughs> that is like, right. it, I'll talk about the Arcadian level the, right. here, man. The pool, the pond, the, the ocean. The ocean is a bigger, 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 bigger pond. Yeah. The pool? Much different, dude. You don't see a lot of demon watches out here in the, in the pools. Dude, uh, back in Smash 4, there was like the one player that I would play against in my college, and like we would literally go to game 10 like every week that we like played. Yeah. And it was just like, it, it, it carries over a lot of things. So, like, I feel like all game watches, like, game plan is like the same. You know, you're yeah. like, I'm going to space with back air. I'm going to try to with punish with dash attack. Right, you know? right. You and know his if, tools. Yeah. If if I land with down air, know that I'm going to up B immediately afterwards. So there's a lot of things where Game Watch is, does that. Like, if you mm. know what they're going to do, then yeah. like you can definitely plan your game around it. At, but at this, at this point, Shadow should have known that the shield standoff, you should make the first grab first because shield grabs cancel other grabs. That's the worst thing that's going to happen. Sometimes if you're holding shield too long, don't take that time. You got to go for it. I mean, I say like it's not even worth it to go for the, the shield grab just because game wants you to just up B immediately. So yeah. I'd say just roll away. You know, out of shield options, man, you have you have options. Don't stand there and give your opponent the opportunity to go for the grab first. Right. Especially in the standoff. Immediately Shadow Wolf is still struggling, but he's making closer percent. I mean, the top tier pick, this is what kind of makes the money back at home, right? You want to make sure you have the best foot forward. Mark wasn't going to be the tool he needed, but hopefully Wolf is because he got the percent on him. Watch the landing here, and he anticipated the roll get up. Yeah. I mean, he definitely learned from the last time that he was like, okay, up smash, I can't punish the up smash because the down yeah. smash is coming right, uh, right afterwards. So, yet again, I love how Shadow Wolf is definitely adapting oh. to the matchup, but unfortunately, he cannot adapt to that combo right there. Yeah, it's such a cut off guard, but that's like I said, right? How many times do you fight a character like this? But when you go ahead and play a game competitively, you kind of got to know those matchups. Those ones that you least expect. Back throw that's going to take stage control and 
the ability to get a, go for an edge guard. I do like the fact that this time Shadow Wolf kind of letting go of the ledge, trying to anticipate him coming with a hot option or scenario. But unfortunately, man, Yoshi freaking out here, putting in all the stops. And yet again, no, we're treating no. the ledge, but no, like that's going to be hard to recover if you don't know how to tag. Attack. No, not gonna do it, man. This man's holding great DI. You have to. I mean, you said how Game Watch is kind of a threat at, at times. The thing about Game Watch, though, he's still paperweight. So you have to understand, you have to hold the right DI at all times to survive. And yet again, just falling to all these nares. You know, Wolf kind of struggling to land right against him right now. Trying to go for a grab. Careful. Mm -hmm. That side B doesn't sweet spot the ledge. And there's the back air. And it's nice. Good, I like it. Good, yeah, good, he good crossed call, up the shield. Unfortunately, no. Not gonna be it. Ooh, and that's a quick three stock from Yoshi Freak. Yeah. yeah. Where did the stocks go? I mean, like, I felt like they just started the match, and then all of a sudden the, the set's over. Like, yeah. Oh my god. It happens, man. I'm yeah. telling you. But I, I, I had high hopes for him. I see him coming.